Hey guys, welcome back to Making Everyday Magic. My name is Shauna. If you are new here, we are a homeschooling family of four who comes here and just shares what we find, what we learn, what we use all along the way. We focus on secular curriculum choices and I think that's it. And that's all you need to know. Today, let's take a look at studying the world with your kids using the Evan Moore Skill Sharpener Geography. Guys, before we go any further, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, and give these videos a thumbs up. As always, you can find me right on down in the comments or over on Instagram at Making Everyday Magic. Today, I am so excited to share with you. I've made it through the main subjects. I've done art, or I've done language arts, and I've done math, and I've talked with you about what we're using for first and fifth. And next month, I'll be sharing our Temperdoodle Non-Religious Curriculum Kit recaps, which is so crazy because we're already at the place where that's happening because it's about time to order again. You guys know I absolutely love starting with the Timberdoodle non-religious curriculum kits as our base for our year. And then I can customize and tweak and I absolutely love that they put in things that kind of place an emphasis on a on an increasing independence when your kids come to homeschooling, which is great because you're going to want them doing that. I, it works really well for me because I work from home. So I absolutely love that, love them. And I love that by even just looking at the kits, even just looking at the curriculum kits, you can get ideas for things you just did not know existed. And that is what happened uh, as soon as we got our second grade kit. That's what we started with for my oldest. We got our second grade kit started with that and I was just exposed to so many things, fun learning, game learning, so many things that I just didn't know existed. And one of those things is the Skill Sharpeners Geography Series from Evan Moore. Now I have used, we've got, I've used Kinder first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. I believe in their kits, they go up through sixth. Uh, from the Evan Moore Company. It's really handy. It's just a wonderful kind of like easy workbook style curriculum company that is easily adaptable. They're used in public schools and in homeschools because they're just really gosh darned easy to use. Now, specifically why I love these is because it is like geography and social studies kind of in one. And I like, you can see that the pages are color coded for the different, can you see that? Focus. The pages are color coded for the different um, like subjects. So we are using both this year and I'll give you a little down shoot probably of both of them. Uh, but in the front, it tells you what the sections are and it goes through all kinds of different things. But what I love about it is that the book has vocabulary, hands-on activities, project suggestions, reading selections. Um, it shows them, it's so simple to use. You can do one page a day and in doing one page a day, which they almost always do more because they like them and they enjoy them, which makes my life so much easier, guys. And has, as you can see by just doing a page a day, we are on, let's see, we are on 107 of, Let's rip, rip, rip. 107 of 135 pages. So we will easily finish this this year. No problems at all. And there's also an answer guide in the back. Uh, and the pages are perforated, which I absolutely love. But I like that it takes a different approach than just geography, but it's also not just social studies. I like that it's both. It encourages us to learn more. My older daughter loves the reading passages. Uh, my younger daughter is really learning how to use the skills that are included in the book and I just personally love them. So let's pop over. I'll do a little down shot. I'll give you the look at both books because why not? Um, but just a quick recap. I love the Skill Sharpeners Geography from Evan Moore. They've got it from like K through six. They're awesome. They're amazing. And they are included in the Timber Doodle kits. I believe they are in both the regular and the non-religious, which is my preference. Um, so I will have these linked down below for you, both the kit and the specific books, but super cool, super awesome. Let's pop over into a down shoot. Okay guys, so here are the Evan Moore Skill Sharpeners Geography. Um, let's start with level one. So as you can see, it has map skills, projects, and, uh, and activities, places, and environments. Super easy. It goes through the table of contents, tells you what all it goes over, and it goes through. These are the different color coded sections. The color coding matches the color coding on the pages. The world in spatial terms, 
places and religion regions places and regions physical symptoms human systems environment and society and then it does reading selections visual literacy vocabulary hands-on activities and as you can see it's just really simple large print but up in the top corner it tells you the concept maps or geographic representations and across the top it tells you what it's doing so that's the reading visual literacy we've got cutouts we've got matchers we've got projects word searches um, all kinds of things. It's really fun. My kids really like it and it's so easy. It's just a page a day, just a page a day gets it done in a year. It doesn't have to be stressful. Um, and they enjoy it. So I like that very much. Now, uh, again, in the back, you've got your answers. If you need those, we've got skill sharpener geography here for level five and it goes through their setup the same kind of way. It just gets more in depth as they get older. So we've got essential element, the world in spatial terms, places and regions, physical systems, human systems, human systems continued, environment and society and the uses of geography. Phone map, you reading a phone map, here's the concept, there's reading. I like that all the pages are perforated because some of them for the activities you really wanna pull out. Um, but this has a lot more reading and pictures, which is really nice. And she gets so excited to share them with us. She loves to, like when she was reading about dinosaurs, she really wanted to share that with her sister. Uh, we have had such a great time going through these books. They're really pretty. They're really awesome. Oh, this is really exciting. Human system. So it's a subway system because that's a human system that's been put in place, which is so fun. We are excited. It's, it's gorgeous. It's pretty to do. Um, it's simple, 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 which is honestly sometimes just what you need simple and enjoyable so that is a little bit closer look at the skill sharpeners edition of geography from evan moore and this is our first grade and fifth grade again i'll have all the links and uh, kits and things linked down below but we really like them thanks to the people at timberdoodle for introducing us to them Guys, I hope that you found any of that helpful, entertaining, or informative. If you did, please scroll down, hit the big red subscribe button, turn on the bell for notifications, and give this video a thumbs up. As always, you can find me down in the comments or over on Instagram at Making Everyday Magic. I will have everything linked down below. I just, I love the Evan Moore, like, I did a page a day. It does not get easier than page a day. And even, like, my first grader, for the most part, can, like, read or at least figure out what she has to do all on her own. So these are those perfect things that like when one sibling is doing something, the other one can be doing this. Or if I'm running late, like Sam filming and I need them to get started, I'm like, go ahead and start and they can do it like on their own or easy help each other. It's like, these things are awesome and because they're just so easy, but it's also great information, great jump points because there are projects, cutting it out, gluing it in, vocabulary terms. So you really can. Uh, kind of expand it a bit if you want to, but you're also just checking the box if that's all you need to do. So love it. Love them. Thanks to the people over at Timberdoodle for including them in the kits and therefore exposing me to them. Huge shout out to Geography uh, from Evanmore. Thanks, guys.